And hello folks, it is I, Kamikaze, back after the end of the second trial. Oh, I just, I don't understand why, but I mean, they are kids, we are kids, I mean, it's, rationality is not our best suit. Sniff, wait, question mark, who's question mark? Sniff, sniff. Do I smell food? Do I get food? Oh! Sexy! I know, I shouldn't cry. She's also sad. I'm sorry. But... I've had enough. I can't take it anymore. Well, don't do anything rash. Getting out of here anytime soon? It's impossible. I can't let myself think about how much I want to get out of here. If I keep thinking like that, I might decide to... Decide to what? It better not be what I'm thinking. I got a rattling in my headpiece. Donuts. Yes, donuts! Perfect choice. Let's go get some. Okay. Do I get a kid? Nope, I guess not. <laughs> Don't cry, it's gonna make me sad. Wait, how are you gonna get donuts? The thing closes at 10. What the hell is that? Huh? Huh? I don't know what that sound is, but... Okay. At this point, I'm gonna say run. I'm just expecting some kind of Monokuma bot coming after mm. you to render your flesh. And not in any good way. I don't think there is a good way, but still. But... What do you mean, but? Don't go! Gasp. What the hell?! Is that a robot? A next generation legend! Stand tall, galactic hero! Daily life. Well, looks like I started the third chapter. The morning after the conclusion of the second class trial. Everyone met up in the dining hall just like always, and I expected it to start like any other day. That's what I expected, but... Um... Hmm. Should she eat bad donuts? Oh! Mm. So then. It looks that way. How about that? You look like you have died and come back in a thriller music video. Impossible. Wake up! Taka hasn't said a word since everything happened yesterday. One look at his face shows he hasn't slept a wink last night. It must be because of Mondo. The two of them became so close. And then he finds out Mondo killed Chihiro. And then... Having to watch Mondo get punished and nothing he could do about it i can't even imagine what must have been done to him well you're going to die fat ass i mean what <laughs> it's like <laughs> Uh, 
I just foresee you trying to kill us. Because I still don't trust you at all. What? To live here forever? Well... <sighs> Friends? Family? A 9 to 5? No, not a 9 to 5 job. Screw that. I'd rather be here. Is that okay? What the hell are you talking about now? Huh? How did you verbally speak a star? Here we go! There is nothing to be done. You know? You? After cowering in fear, you're going to take lead now. Oh, mighty leader, lead me to the leady leadiness. Searching? I'm right, right? Perhaps. Yes. Hmm. I really doubt it at the rate we're going, but... Well, then... <sighs> if she's really accepted living here, then she might be the greatest help of us all. Unless she wants to stay here, then she might murder to do so. Um... And just as we were starting to come together, she barged in and ruined the conversation. So oh god, I forgot all about her. Oh. This is going to cause a problem. What? Uh, um. Yes! Ah, uh, you better not. Oh, this is going to suck. You SOB! That tongue is nothing short of an amazing feat. Uh, um... <laughs> you know, if Toko were to kill herself by having her split personality kill herself, would that be considered a murder or a suicide? <laughs> You're right. Drink. Let's hurry up and eat so we can start our investigation. Is there any tranquilizers in the warehouse? Because I could definitely use one right now. On her. So we were forced to eat breakfast with a murderer. And after our much needed but very annoying meal, we set to work looking around the school. Oh, I get a move. Well, there's no point in... Investigating here, I need to go, uh, actually, I need to go spend my money. Wait, that's this way. Alright, so let's make this quick. I got a, uh, a black croissant. Uh, 
uh, a loincloth with a leaf. I have no idea what that was. Okay, got that again. What is that sound for? Ooh, another sword. Breakfast cereal? Mashed potatoes? Something? I'm trying to spend my coins faster. Oh, a beautiful ring! I still don't know what that is. And that's the worm on the string, right? Oh, so is that what that sound does? Ooh, that's kind of cool. Whoa, what the hell is this? Two luckies? And ramen. All right, let's spend some more coins. An entire lunchbox. Oh, I needed another one of those. Another ring. More bandages. And there's the last of my coins there. And show me the money! Oh, scissors! I know who I can give scissors to! I can give them to Choco because I am freaking insane. Oh, okay. Let's get the hell out of here. I keep trying to rotate myself around. Alright, so next stairs, right? Oh, wrong way. I haven't seen anyone. I wonder where they're at. Well, obviously this floor. Yo, spiky dude, what's up? Could it be? Hmm. Well, there. Obviously, a new floor is going to be lifted up, and this is just a weird area. Oh, well. Wait, what? Where's the third floor? Ah, there we are. The third floor of Hope Peaks Academy. I wonder what we're going to find this time. What's up, Doc? A rec room. Uh, what's over here? Oh, that's stairs down. 3B, 3A. Oh, cool! Oh, please tell me I can play some of these things. Hmm. So this is... Let's see. I would never imagine a school having a place like this. Are they recent magazines? Isn't it wonderful? Listen up! Expound? Ba -bum, ba -bum. Huh. Well, thanks for letting me know so about the swimsuits. Then. Kind of what? Watch out! 
the world has come to an end, hasn't it? And we're in this bomb shelter of a place, being killed for the amusement of our lords! Resurrected from cryogenic stasis to provide amusement and death and bloody destruction. There's millions of kids in cryogenic stasis below the school. I know, right? It bothers me too. Most unfortunate. Really? Oh, that was a fun game. With Othello, you always claim the corners. Do everything you can because the cor corners rule the world. There's even a dartboard. Did Monokuma put this up here or was it always a part of the school? I just spent all my coins. Thank you. That's a good point. I mean, unless you have all the back issues. Wait, is this booze? Looks like some kind of bottle, but what the heck is it? Maybe it's just for decoration or something. There's something to the right of that. Why can't I look? There it is. That's a beat-up old locker. Doesn't seem especially important right now, so I don't need to open it. Our clock. Let's play the slot machine. Let me play the slot machine. Oh, come on. There is a slot machine, and you're not going to let... That's so dumb. I want to see what the Monokuma slot machine has to offer. There is nothing to be done. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut it. Wait, what's over here? Because obviously it's not an exit. Oh, it is the exit. What? Fine. I'll leave the area. Up yours, rec room. Um, I don't know why you're investigating this corner, but if you have to use the restroom, there's... Just use the corner. It would seem... Did you expect the fourth? Whew. It's a particle accelerator. I have no idea. Physics room. What the hell? Whoa! That's creepy. Let's go in. Boobs! At first glance, it looks like any normal art room. But something seems off. Or multiple somethings. It's a Venus statue. Yep. Definitely very art roomish. This is a statue of Neo. I've never really heard anyone using Neo statue for life drawing classes or whatever. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Is this a statue of Monokuma? Who would ever want to make something like that? Still, the quality is surprising. Nice. Um, what about the wall? There are paintings lining the walls. Is this really art? It looks just like a bunch of crappy graffiti to me. And let's talk to the fat guy. Takes up too much <laughs> visual space. So, Fumi, do you like sculptures and figurines and stuff? Yes, indeed. I don't know what how that's borderline, but okay. <laughs> Pokemon. But one of your elite is missing. Oh, unless you count yourself, right? You know nothing! Oh, never mind. Yes, indeed. Oh. Never <laughs> mind. Again. I see. Well, good luck with that. What? 
What else would I need to look at? I've looked at that. I've looked at that. Nothing there. Wait, there's a door. Well, I think I found where all the murders take place. This is the repository that's attached to the art room. It's used to store different artsy things. And that's weird. There's something on the floor. Looks like a picture. But as I stretch out my hand to pick it up, almost on its own, my hand froze. Whoa! It's all three of them! Holy crap! What? It's Mondo, uh, Leon, and Shihiro. Yeah, I can't remember shit. Don't get mad at me. Shihiro, Leon, Mondo. And they were smiling. What is this? Questions started racing through my head. One after another. Why is it only these three people? What are they doing together? How come they're smiling like that? When was it taken? Who took it? Where's the camera they used? How did they get it developed? And the picture, the window in the class the window in the classroom isn't boarded up. There's no better plates covering it. Which means wherever this picture was taken, it wasn't here at Hope's Peak. But there was no time to find an answer. All the questions floating in my head were quickly drowned out by Bong 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 Bong. <laughs> nope, never mind. Close enough. Why did you leave it here, jackass? Monaco appeared out of nowhere and snatched the photo, and any chance I had at answers evaporated. Ha! Isn't that wonderful? But all three of them are dead. It's like you knew that was going to happen. What's going on with that picture? Do you know? Why can't you give me a straight answer? Never mind. I don't even know why I bothered asking. It's just so freaking glorious. Well, let's look at all the weapons we have in this room, like... Like saws and... Oh, I guess I can't click that stuff, but I can. The mallets, right? Yep. There are wooden mallets hanging on the wall. If I had to guess, I'd say they're used for making sculptures. A dolly. They must use this to move all these statues around. Or dead bodies. Jeez, I'm looking at everything as how it would be used in a murder. What's with these stupid drawings on the walls? There's nothing else here. Fine. Goodbye. Wait, where the hell am I? Did I come from the- Yep, she's peeing in the corner, so I'm going- What are these green things on the sides of these? Oh well, don't care. Uh, whoop. Well, found the way up. Whoa. Ah, the physics lab. Whoop. What the hell is this? This is the physics lab. It's less like a classroom and more like some kind of research institute. I didn't mean to click that, but okay. This machine obviously has some kind of purpose, but... I don't know anything about physics to begin with, so I wouldn't have a clue where to start with this. What do I use, zombie boy? Hey, Taka, don't you think this place is some kind of research institute? Still no reaction. How did he get here? Did someone carry him? What's up this with this ridiculously big machine? 
Ah, oh, damn bear. What? <laughs> yeah, I'm fine with that. It's better than being here. Huh? Phew. That's a time machine? You're you can't be serious. What tragedy? One minute? One minute. I mean, what can you do? I mean, if you did anything in this building and ran here, by the time you did that, you would just catch yourself running in here. Then what is it? Hey, um... Oh, that's a load of crap. You're telling me this is an air purifier. In other words... You guys? Let's push all the buttons. This huge thing is just an air purifier. And more than that, to go out of your way and say something you know will hurt someone who's already suffering. God damn you. Nice. Yeah, that's what I needed. It was a nice for that one. Oh, it's a back room. More murderous toys. Oh. This is the equipment room. It's super disorganized and there's a strange chemical smell in the air. Uh -huh. I'm getting seriously excited! Uh -huh. Of course, Genocide Jack likes it. That just goes to show how disgusting it really is. Pendulums, wheels, rail segments, all equipment is scattered all over. They're all covered in dust, too. They have obviously haven't been used in a long time. Why is everything covered in dust in this prestigious school? There's a bunch of files here, probably old lab files or research data. Why don't I look at try and look at dates, try and figure something else out here? Well, there's things I can't read. Nope, already did that. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm gone. Goodbye. Anything else in here I can look at? I don't see how this is an air purifier. We must use these for physics experiments and stuff. There's materials, pulleys, and steel plates, magnets, and all kinds of stuff I don't even recognize. It's too loud in here. I'm gonna go now. What? What else do I need to look at? Oh! Well, this is... This is a digital camera. It's got some, some kind of weird character on it. It's kind of beat up, but it looks like it still turns on just fine. Yep, still works. I should show the others later. Hmm, I discovered lots of stuff, and it was all strange, but I don't know if any of it was an actual clue. I'm just getting more confused. Maybe I should head to the dining hall and talk about it with everyone else. For now, I should head to the dining hall, just like I said previously stated in that previous statement. But at this point, I'm going to call the episode here. Because when I got back to the dining hall, the first thing I noticed was, it's the end of the episode. 
So please remember, if you're having fun, like, subscribe, comment, do all the fun things. I'll catch you guys in the next episode of Danganronpa 1.